Now, the Fox Illinois Sports Desk, sponsored by Route 66 Solar. All good things must come to an end. And for Coleman Hawkins, he emphasized that same sentiment. And he told me on Saturday that after an unbelievable and dedicated career at Illinois, he told me that after the loss against UConn, that he likely played his last game in the orange and blue. I think probably this is going to be my last year in the Illinois jersey. Um, you know, I've, I feel like I've done a lot in these four years. And, I, you know, I think the time comes where uh, a good thing comes to an end, and I'm super grateful for the opportunity. Uh, I'm super grateful for everything I've been blessed with, but I think this was my last, last ride in the Illinois uniform, yeah. Illinois will lose a large group of their key players from the 2023 to 2024 season. A part of that group, Marcus Domas, Quincy Gurrier, Coleman Hawkins, Terrence Shannon Jr., and Justin Harmon. Illinois will move into a different era of Illini basketball, but the future is bright. Amani Hansbury and Draven Gibbs Lawhorn gained valuable minutes off the bench this season as freshmen. And while the future of the transfer portal is in question when it comes to who's returning for Illinois, Ty Rogers and Sincere Harris are expected to be back with valuable minutes under their belt. When speaking with Justin Harmon on Saturday, he's confident in those returners. Um, they, they, it's not going to be the first time uh, that they've been through this, so like they're going to know how it feels to lose, and they're going to they gonna, um, think about it when they when they're in the game, and uh, they're going to just play their hardest, and they're going to try to get a uh, juice to the young guys that's coming in, and they're going to they gonna help them win just like uh, we helped them win this year. So it's, I'm so proud of the young guys. They, they're going to have a great year next year. I fully expect Illinois to look for a two-point guard in the transfer portal, but after an Elite Eight run, the future is bright. Like I said, all good things must come to an end. That'll wrap up our coverage here at the TD Garden in Boston after a special season for Illinois and an Elite Eight run with many highs. I'm Dante Furco. Don't miss a video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel today for more Central Illinois news.